Hello YouTube modelers, Dwayne, Doozers Models. Uh, just doing a quick bench update, showing you guys what I've been up to. Um, as you can see in front of you, I got the Mad Mudder Chevy Blazer kit. I did my own interpretation on it. It's just really loosely mocked up right now. So I'll show you where we're at on it. Uh, we'll move the box out of the way. And there it is. I'm not doing it as a Mad Mudder. I'm doing it as just a lifted up 4x4. Um, as you can see, I closed in the hood, so I took some uh, styrene bits and, and closed it in and sealed up the hood so it doesn't have the big ugly scoop on it anymore. Um, I've got everything, nothing's glued together here, so i got to be a little bit ginger with it. But uh, i got some custom resin wheels and tires on it. I've got the stock lift kit in it. I've got the interior just sitting in it right now. Uh, it's still white plastic. I don't know. I think I might do it a light sort of tan color. Um, you can see the uh, sort of a turquoisey light blue with the white for the two-tone. So that turned out kind of cool. There you can see underneath the hood. Let me see if I can. There you go. There's where I had to put the styrene piece in to cover up the big scoop opening. Um, you can see the tires are just sitting on, the suspension is just sitting in there, nothing's glued down or anything yet. Um, got some work done on the engine, so it's just in paint. I haven't decided what I'm going to do for an intake yet, I'm, I'm still debating. I want to keep it under the hood, so I'm kind of limited. Um, transfer case is painted up, all the shocks and suspension, the rest of it is all done there. So that's a blazer that we've been working on, I think it's turning out kind of cool. Um, the wheels and tires are from uh, Fireball. So for those of you that haven't used Fireball, awesome stuff. Uh, reasonably priced. <coughs> he gets it out to you in a timely fashion and uh, real real quality stuff. Um, the paint is scale finishes. Um, I'll show all that stuff in the final when I get it all buttoned up. But for now, it's just uh, loosely sitting together, like nothing's glued. It's all just roughed in. And so also, I've been working on the, um, where's the box top on that one? For the GI Mechanic motorcycle build, over the last couple of years, I've actually bought half a dozen or a dozen bikes. And so this is a good opportunity to build one. So. I can't quite get it in there, but it's the Z750 FX by Aoshima. Uh, it wasn't a great fitting kit. It's taken quite a bit of work, but with the work, it's actually coming together quite good. Um, so there's the gas tank. I went with a non-metallic blue, gold and white decals. You can barely see where the seam was there, so I'm pretty happy with the outcome of that. Um, the side plates have little decals on the top and little Z750 decals on the sides. The little back piece behind the fender, um, the stripes went on not too bad. Took a little bit of fiddliness on them, but I, I think they went on there pretty good. We've got a few sub-assemblies done. We've got the uh, swing arm and the chain and the brakes on the back put together, so that started. Um, the front was a bit of a bear. The screw didn't quite go in properly. It started spreading it apart and everything broke apart. So it's all gnarled up there. I'm going to have to fix it with some paint. But uh, I took it apart and reworked it and got it together. So it's got the chrome fender. Brakes on both sides. So that's coming along. We'll be going on from that. And the engine is started. So I don't know if you can see it in there. But... It's got the little exhaust ports. It's got the carburetors all on there. It's got the side plates put on. Um, so it started. Um, I got to do some of the wiring and, and different things on it now that come with the kit. But the engine's coming together pretty good. Um, you got to do all the sub assemblies and then put it all together at once with the frame. So. Anyways, that's where we're at. Just thought I'd give you a quick bunch update and, and let you know what we've been working on. Hope you guys are getting lots of work done and uh, hope your stuff's coming out as well as you hope. Uh, coming up on a weekend, so more bench time for everybody there. 
Um, thanks for subbing. Thanks for watching. Thanks for commenting. And uh, build on, gentlemen. We'll see you again soon.